friends, welcome to my channel. If you are new, welcome back. If you are returning, my name is Keisha and I'm here to plan for the week of April 15th through the 21st in my mini happy planner. This is my on the go planner. It goes with me everywhere. Um, I write random stuff in it. Sometimes I write nothing in it, but it's nice to have just in case. So I am going to be using some kit remnants that I have from this planning choco kit. Um, I don't remember what it's called. She doesn't, oh, Wizard Party. Um, some of it is a mix of a, a like a Erin Condren size kit and some of it is a mix of like a monthly. Um, I'm gonna be pulling this in from who knows what, some sort of sticker sheet that I found because there are no days of the week in here anymore. So yeah, let's get to planning. So the first thing that I like to do to start is I like to white out these headers. A couple of reasons why. One, I like the first half of the week to be on this side and these squared plans printables um, have like it across the top and then the bottom. So it's like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I like going Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Uh, only a couple change, but it's still like, you know, I, I want to wipe them out to make them all uniform. So yeah, I again, I'm using these. I think they are from uh, Michael's. If I am not mistaken, my Michaels, my Michaels closest to me, not that there's not Michaels um, elsewhere, but my Michaels closest to me is not selling stickers really much anymore. It's kind of odd and I don't like it. I want to go in for stickers. I don't always love going to Joann's for stickers. I mean, do they sell them? Yes, but I felt like the nice exclusive place was always Michaels and that is not the case anymore so like it's Hobby Lobby and even Hobby Lobby they don't get a turnaround of their stickers very often so it's stinky but oh well all right so the nice thing is is that even though they do not have days of the week in this kit I still happen to have um the dates of the week so let's get that in Monday is the 15th these dates again are from the monthly so 15th Tuesday's the 16th. You can tell it's the monthly because the boxes are a little bit bigger. They're different. Oh, 18th came up first, so we'll put that down right here. 17th, 19th, 20th, and 21st. So, uh, is there a reason why I chose Harry Potter or this wizarding kit for this week? Nope, but I love it. Um, I think I'm going to use this one, this brunette, because I'm brunette. Have you seen this wizard? Put that there. Do I wish that these decorative boxes were a little bit smaller? Yes, but... You just take what you can get. I'm gonna do this um, this week sticker. And I'm gonna put it up a little bit higher than I originally planned. Then I think, at least I thought that there were some checklists in here. Yep, okay. Let's do green, nope. Let's do yellow. I would say I would do red because I am a Gryffindor, but there is no red in this kit, which is very interesting. It has all of the house colors, except for Gryffindor. So it's fine, it's fine. Okay, this week, then Monday, um, we'll do a box for Layla's lunches, or lunch, I'm sorry. And then we'll pull in the cute birdie bots with the butterbeer, and I'll just line these up next to each other. Okay, and Monday, we don't have anything. Tuesday, make sure that I'm still in frame. Tuesday, we have, so we'll do Layla's lunch, but then I also have to put that Layla has gymnastics this date, this day, I should say. There's one for Layla's lunch. And then we will pull in this spells one. Put it right here. 
Not a ton of room, but that's okay. Oh, the green one is crooked, of course. Oh, well. Okay. Then we'll use this, cream, this green one. It says Polyjuice Potion Beginner's Guide to Transfiguration. So cute. Put this one up high. Up higher, I should say. And for this one, okay, we need to put Layla's Lunch in. But also... No, where can I put Layla's lunch? And maybe I can put it on a skinnier one. What? Oh, it's Wednesday. She doesn't do lunch. She, my mom picks her up. Okay, so Wednesday after school, I'm gonna do a bigger one because Layla has a dress rehearsal. Okay, and these stickers are on glossy paper. I don't really like using glossy much anymore. It picks up on all of your, like, um, all of your oils on your skin so it is not always my favorite to use i'm going to use this double box scene on saturday and sunday i really wish that i could use this big one but yeah it's not really gonna happen but the double box is cute it's from like their common room with an h and a g with letters coming out it's kind of a cute this one's a school one do that one on Thursday. Thursday's gonna be a little crazy, but I'll put it up higher. And then this one has Hedwig and then the Gryffindor scarf for Friday. Let's see. So for Friday, Layla's lunch, I will do this one. And then we don't have anything Friday afternoon. Thursday afternoon is going to be kind of a crazy day as well because we have skate and Layla has a performance and that is on Crooked. I thought I straightened it, but I didn't and I'm ripping the pages, that's okay. Okay, I will just throw that away and get a new box. Thank goodness I have lots of leftover remnants from this. I think I used it a couple years ago, to be honest with you. Um, this is Trey's last skate uh, until the next session. Um, for Layla's lunch, I'm gonna use this gray. It's a bill do, but I'm just gonna cut off the bill do. So it's like a little bit, it's like a three quarter size of a box. We'll put that right here. And hopefully all the other information will fit in that box. Saturday, Sunday, we don't have anything going on. So yeah, here's what I have left over from this the remnants, I have the Have You Seen This Wizard. I did use it, but I used the brunette instead. So I'll have like all the headers, the dates. These are so cute. So there's still the Have You Seen This Wizard, but like look at how cute the girl scene is. Oh, so cute. All the deco, maybe I should put some deco in. Maybe I will. Okay, so we have Nearly Headless Nick. We'll put him right here. We have a chocolate frog. We have two different versions of the chocolate frog. One's dark and one's light. Maybe I'll put the chocolate frog, the other chocolate frogs over here, frog over here. We have a Hedwig balloon. We have some packages. I love the butter beer. Then we have the like Hogsmeade sign. Okay. Um, and then let's see. This is a a cupcake with the martyrs map. This is. A chocolate frog case I'm like using the top as deco I never do that this is another cupcake but with a birdie bots beans on top this is packages like headed to school packages we have some pumpkins I think I'm gonna add the poly juice in here right here this one is like a spider I'll do the poly juice potion with this drink next to it let's see if there's any like hangover right here and I don't know if there's any on this side nope okay so let's get this back in the planner and I will show you what it looks like oh my goodness it is so cute I you know this mini planner has been fun to be able to decorate and use all of my leftovers 
Uh, but this sticker kit, I think I'm going to have to go back into my Etsy and see if I can reprint it. It is so cute. Again, it's from Planning Choco. I will uh, link their Etsy shop down below. They are still open. They do a lot of foiling, but their kits are just so cute. So yeah, if you like this video, do not forget to give it a thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel and I hope you guys have a fantastic week. Bye guys. Thank you.